I'm Jackie. And I'm Jacqueline. Ghosts and ghouls of every age, we are vlogging every day. Come with us and you will see Vlogtober officially. This is Mama and me. everybody grab a seat for a vlog every day. That's right, full of spooky things, food and chit chatting. A festive month for us all to frolic in the night. It's our vlog, come on over. Yes, it's time for a Vlogtober. Mom is the one that will make you laugh good. Clever one liner, sharp witted as she should. Jacqueline is a one that can dance all day. Throwing it down puts it on display. Vlogtober is here, Vlogtober is here. Vlogtober is here, Vlogtober is here. If you have been following us through Vlogtober, you know our ghost light saga at from Target. Target. We went literally, you guys, to 13 or 15 targets looking for this light. I think now that those, those, they're gone. They're gone. It's almost now. the end of the month, you guys. They're not and getting them in anymore. I don't think so. Yeah. So like the target light, ghost light, yes. these were also elusive. Hard to find, you guys. Yes. And when we heard about them coming out, <laughs> we knew we had to get them because we couldn't get that target ghost yeah. light. So we're, we're like, you know what? If we can't get that, we're going to get all three of these. McDonald's Halloween buckets. Jacqueline had a reminder on her phone yes. the day they came out so we would remember. The day before. Yes, the day before. So we'd so know. We could be ready. For yeah, next we'd be day. ready. We'd yeah. be ready. And you guys, that is so amazing. He literally is the one that found all of them. Every single one of them. I mean, we went two to some, but we didn't find them. We did. We didn't find one of the ones we went to. Dad literally is so fast. He's like, he's like the Flash. He is. He's like speeding all the, well, not speeding. Let's, okay, <laughs> hold on. <laughs> hold on. <laughs> Following the speed yes. limit, okay? I'm just saying, he was so quick. He went to so many different McDonald's. Each McDonald's had a different bucket. No one McDonald's that any of us went to had all three at the same time. Oh no. They only had one. And I also will say most of the McDonald's had the ghost bucket only. Like that was the majority. I'll hold them up for you guys, but I'll also put in a clip of it separately, of it a bit more focused so you can see yes. the design a little bit yes. better. So here we have McBoo. And here's his matching stickers. Yes, so it came with a little sticker insert. And then on the back are skeletons and you could place the stickers over the skeletons and like dress them up. Isn't that so cute? Which is guys. really cute. So cute. And that is also what the past buckets would come with. Or some of them. Some anyway. of them. Some yeah. of them. We also got Mick Pumpkin. <laughs> which is a funny name. Mick Pumpkin. That's what it says. <laughs> Mick Pumpkin. Mick Pumpkin. <laughs> and that one came with a different set of stickers. Right. But same skeleton bodies yes. on the back. But look how cute these costumes are, you guys. So cute to do that, okay? All right. And Jacqueline, and, like, will sh again, she'll show you a close-up. And last but not least, we have McGoblin, which I thought was called McWitch at first. <laughs> I think it's, it, it looks like a witch right, to it me. It looks like a witch, right? And all of these, by the way, have three different faces on them. Yes. Uh, so yeah, that one came with another different sticker pack here. And isn't that cute, you guys, how each one has the color coded? Yes. <laughs> sticker pack yes, things. Yes, exactly. So it, cute. It, it's color coordinated. Yes. Yes. So, so cute, you guys. <sighs> so a big thanks to Dad Flicker. I mean, he did a good job. Like, yes. I can't believe he even found all of them. It was great. Seriously, you guys. Yeah. And it, it was so cute. And Dad, like, went rolling, like, to all these McDonald's so quickly. He got that white one first. Yep. Then he got the, the green, green one. Then yeah. we were waiting for the orange. And then the closest McDonald's I went to the day before, and she said, oh, only white. Maybe tomorrow we'll have orange. And I don't think so they did. So dad, no, but remember what happened? Dad went to that one for lunch, and she goes, they're not at in yet. We had to wait, we're waiting for them to come in. That's right. And then dad went back later, and sure enough, it was the orange, and he yes. got the orange. Totally random. You just, I guess, have to keep checking them. Right. All the different ones to see when they get them in. So don't give up, you guys. Right. And I think yeah. it's until Halloween. So you could keep checking. Right. You know, see if they have them, if you haven't been able to find all three yet. Yeah. Hopefully but, yeah. They, they still have them, you guys. And we, we just got finished our collection. That's why we waited so long to do the video. It's not like we had these two weeks ago. Right. And uh, and another cute thing, if you guys notice, this, they used to have lids, you guys, way back right. when. No more lids. Now it's a fake lid, which is a hat on the 
That's why I think this is a witch. Right? It's a witch hat. I thought a goblin's more of like a... Even though it says goblin. Like a gargoyle-y type yeah. thing. Like, you know, but... So see, they're all fake hats. It's just part of the lid, you guys. So it's not right. even a, a real, you know, lid yeah. there. It's still cute. You know, cute to set Very out cute. as decoration, of course, yes. around the house, which we've been doing <laughs> prior to filming this video. And Except they're crooked I was going to say, <laughs> go ahead, tell them. <laughs> so funny, when I was looking online, like on Instagram and just like all the different kinds of social media you can think of, people were posting, right, that they found all three of the buckets. So they would put a picture of them. All of the faces were in the center of the buckets that these people were posting pictures of. But not ours. But not ours. <laughs> not a single one of ours. Actually, no way, I take it back. That one, that's the only one. This ghost one has one of the faces right in the middle of the handle. The other two do not. Like this one's a little off center, right? Mm -hmm. They're a little askew. A little askew. This which, side's real off. That side, <laughs> I don't know what's going on with that one. So you know but, what? They shouldn't have done three faces then. They should have did two. two. One on each side of the hat so it'd be straight, you guys. And look, if you notice, Mick Pumpkin, look, hold that one up again. His faces are way farther away from each other than those two. Yeah. Mom and I are very like, everything needs to be straight, you know. Nice and tidy. Exactly. So that bothered us a little bit. I know. If anyone else is out there that's like that, yeah, let, let us, us know. know in the comments. So we have them in front of the fireplace, you guys, but we kind of tilt them like this way. Like, so when we're walking we by, can we can see the face. Yeah. So you guys, we have a vintage bucket. It's not really that old, but 2016, you know, it's a few years old. You guys, this was the last bucket we ever got from McDonald's. I think we had more. I think I, I got rid of it, you guys. I, 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 it must have been a few years ago when I was like, oh, let's get rid of some stuff because I don't think I would have got rid of those buckets. I don't right. think you would have gotten rid of them though, even if we were I don't know, well, where are they then? I don't know. This is so special, you guys. Again, there's no lid, but look at the top of this bucket, you guys. This is from 2016 and it was the 50th anniversary of the Peanuts, you know, with Charlie Brown. Here he is. It's the Great Pumpkin Charlie Brown. And that is yep. from a few years ago. Look how cute you guys, and look mm -hmm. at the handle. But you guys, you know what's funny? This also came with stickers, and I must have told, look at that, Jacqueline or Jake. Well, you were 16. I was 16. So, so. I must have told the kids, don't touch those stickers. <laughs> don't you dare touch them, because they're all intact. Look how cute you guys. And if you look on the back, there's even a coupon back there. And what did this coupon and look, expire? Look what it says, look. So you could save $3 when you buy a DVD or Blu-ray of It's the Great Pumpkin, Charlie Brown. Mm -hmm. And you can also, back then, scan Wait. the bucket and unlock a Wait. game. What? Well, we tried you guys to scan the app, like, or scan the pail, but it's not working. It's right. not working. We tried it off camera yeah. and it didn't work. I thought maybe there was like a, like a skew on here. Right, the app seems a bit outdated. And then you guys, oh my gosh, let me know if you guys out there remember Blockbuster video stores, first of all. Blockbuster was such a huge part of our lives when Jake was a little boy because that's where we got our videos from to watch at home. And you guys, what fun it was yep. on a Friday night or Saturday night to go down to Blockbuster and stroll the aisles looking for what video you wanted. You got And games too. You guys, seriously. You could rent video games too. It was such like an iconic thing. If, if nobody, like for a lot of people who didn't do that, they can't understand. But for us who, we rem who remember, it was such a fun thing to do. And sometimes they wouldn't have the video you were looking for. But then you guys, what they would do, they would get Disney movies in. But it would be a whole like pack. So if you ordered it through Blockbuster to buy it, and that's why we have so many of those Disney movies. Right. It would not only come in a really nice VHS case, but something would come with it. Like right. you'd get a print of the movie, uh, like like a nice size print that you could frame. So we did that so much, mm -hmm. you guys. We have so many packs that we bought there. At times they would have a play pack that would come with different things inside. And this is one of them, you guys. So we saved this from Blockbuster. It's so cute. Basically it's a candy bucket. There's the top. Yep. You guys, it's so cute. And it's a pumpkin. And on this side it says Blockbuster Play Pack. Yeah, right there. And let me see if there's a date back here, you guys. Oh, yeah, I wonder. Um, 1997. Oh, Which 97. makes sense, you guys, because Jake was um, 
four years old. And this one does have a lid, and it's so cute because it's yes. the pumpkin's head. Yes. And then the mouth, like the opening. Like Mama's cute? saying. And so this very last bucket we have is from Jack in the Box. Yeah, so, so cute. other fast food places would get Halloween buckets in. This is the only other one we have, though. I know. Well, that we know of anyway. Unless I misplaced them somewhere. Right. So here it is. It's a black and white bucket. There's the handle. No lid or anything. And uh, just has some skeletons on it. And we didn't realize, but when we brought it, it was in the garage. So when we brought it in the house, it was glowing. Yes. And we did not know that it glowed in the dark. I, I'm sure we knew back then when we bought it. Right. Yes. So we'll put in a picture of it glowing in the dark. Yes. But so neat. So I didn't even know that. And I'm sure it had a kid's meal in it from Jack in the Box. I'm sure it probably. did. I'm yeah. sure it did. So I just think that's really neat that uh, not only McDonald's had a Halloween bucket in the yeah. past. But anyway, you guys, so we just thought you guys would have fun seeing those. Yeah. yeah. I thought we'd make a little video about it. And two, a lot of people were asking like questions on our Instagram when we posted a picture of the ghost. Oh, okay. So, you know, maybe this will give you a little insight um, on like how to find them. But really, it's just luck. That's, that's how to find it. It is, you guys. And ask them. First of all, ask either go inside so you don't have to wait in line, in the car line, um, without even getting anything. But run inside and say, what color buckets do you have? Is there only one color? Can I get more than one? You know, can I get the white? And the, who knows if they have right. more than one? Yeah. But just ask questions. But hopefully you guys can find these. And I think the reason these were, are so popular, because not only because they're back, right, but because they're the replicas from before. Exactly. Yeah. They look almost identical to the previous ones that they had a long time ago. Were they lids back then? I think some of them were, some of them were. Oh. The, this one definitely had a lid at one point. I think, so think they all did though. Yeah. No, I think they all did. I remember. Yes. Like on this I think I do one. remember. It was kind of bubbly. You said it, yeah. So yes, again, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> and give the video a thumbs up you guys because it helps us out yeah and let us know in the comments if you have found all three buckets some right. people found them fast some people found them literally i swear like the first or second day i want to say you did tell me that it that was so random fast. person you saw that they found them like in like within less yeah. than a week it would just be all like three. on my explore page and i'd be like how did they already get them i know all right so thanks so much for watching and we'll see you next <laughs> time bye everybody. bye guys